Mm, mm, mm. God, Lee, this chick with this red hair, man. Oh my gosh. Guys, do me a favor. I need y'all to go follow me on Instagram right now. Damien Cryer Senior, all lower casings, bro. If y'all want to see me continue exposing, because I'm never stopping. Let's see what this chick about with this red hair real quick. Let's see what's up. Hey, how you doing, beautiful? Sheesh, what's your name? For you, Foxy Red. Why are you looking all at my shoes like that, Foxy Red? You don't like my FUBUs? Baby, it's 2020 through 2023, and you wearing FUBUs. What's wrong with FUBUs? You don't like FUBUs? It's like a good quality no. shoe. They used to be name brand back in the day. I don't give a f who was name brand back then. You wearing FUBUs? Nah. Well, can I get and you? And then you got, and then you, you work at McDonald's? Yeah, it pays. Are you sure you can, you can handle what I'm coming with? McDonald's pay the bills. You have MySpace or anything? Can I follow you? MySpace. You don't. You don't have MySpace or something. You got Instagram or Instagram? Not a MySpace. You got a boyfriend? No, I, that, that ain't got nothing to do with you when you come in with Fubu's and a McDonald's shirt thing. But it and pays. You got a son visor hat. But it come pays on, the bills. Me. I'm trying to. I don't care about none of that. You ain't. You can't afford my bills when you come in with Fubu's and and the. And the but I'm a hard working man. Well, I'm sorry to bother you, ma'am. You have a nice day. I Maybe I should, I would, I just go. Yeah, I'm going to have a nice day. Look, just, just whoever you know, make sure she puts you together before you try to approach me. I understand. Thank you, ma'am. Sorry to bother you. Wow. She hurt my feelings with that. Bro. Talking about my. Hey. Whoa. Oh. Hey, what's up? Oh. Hey, we ain't, we ain't even finna play like that. You what do you mean? Royce? Yeah, this is one of my cars. Why? Is that shocking one to you or of something? Your cars? But you got franchises? I know you. I know, I know you at the door. You at the window. You ain't making what the. F I, you are a Rolls Royce. I know you ain't rocking with me because of my shoes and my shirt, but. But I was... Nah, but if you come in like this, then I feel like we're on the same type of time. Well, I work hard every day. Shouldn't every owner of franchise have a Rolls Royce? That would make sense for an owner of multiple restaurants that... Not nah, baby, you came with FUBU's and a McDonald's shirt with a, a sun visor hat. It's you wasn't because, given. You wasn't because, given Rolls Royce. You was given mother Kia. It's because I don't wash... a Honda. It's because I don't wash my employees' work. I actually get on the front lines okay, with mom. Okay, so next time when you try to approach me, you let me know what, the, what, what, you, what, you, what you got working with. So I want to see the inside. Like, are you, are you with that? I mean, you ever been inside a Rolls Royce before? You ever been, in, you ever been inside a like me? Oh, my shit. Well, well, let me get a spin from you. Can I get a spin? Let me see what you're working with. Well, good Lord. Uh, my, uh, uh, dad, dad. Yeah, exactly. No, I've never been so, inside of anything so like that. So show me what you working with, and I'm going to show you what I'm working with, Let me baby. open the door for it's you then. Houston. You better act like you're with it. Houston. So you must be from Houston. I'm from Houston, H-Town. All right, all right. Let me get this door for you. Let me get this door for you. You're okay, okay. Watch yourself getting in there. I want you to break one of them beautiful fingernails or something. <laughs> that you're paying for. All right. Oh, that I'm paying for? You implying that I'm paying? Okay. Yes, ma'am. I hope you're comfortable. Gold digger. Jesus Christ. Oh boy, you getting comfortable over there? I'm getting real comfortable. Okay, okay you got the stars in the ceiling. Making yourself right at home, huh? Oh, I can't wait to post this on my story. Okay, so wait a way. So what's your name again? Did you um, say it? Red, Foxy Red, F A U X Y Red. All right, well, I'm Damien Foxy Red. It's very Damien? nice to what's meet you. Name? Damien. Oof. Damien. What's that about? I like that. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh, thank you. I appreciate it. You kind of started me when I opened the door. You got in. Uh -huh. I said, don't break one of your fingernails. You were like, yeah, I'm not worried. You're paying you, for you, it. Because you got me. Look how you come in. You gonna make sure I'm straight at any given point. I haven't given even came moment. yet, but yeah. Um, we'll, 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 so, we'll get to that. We. So tell me about yourself, Foxy Red. So you say that you were born and raised in Houston. Um, from Houston. I'm actually a country girl. I'm outside of Houston. I'm from Freeport, but Houston is all I know. Shopping. Um, and I embrace Houston. So Houston is all I know, baby. Where are you from? Cause I know you ain't from Houston. 
Oh, well, I, I live here, but I'm not from here. I'm from Indiana. <sighs> Yeah, I moved out here about four years ago in search of my beautiful queen. Why know? would you approach me with a McDonald's shirt, but you in a Rolls Royce? Well, be for real. I'll explain why I did that, Foxy Red. I left one of my restaurants to make sure that my restaurant was established right. My employees showed up, and I'm headed to my other one to make sure that it's been ran correctly. When I walk into my restaurants, my mm -hmm. employees don't know that I'm the owner. So I try yeah. to fit in with my environment. So in order for me to fit in with my environment, I have to adapt, dress the part. And that's why I wear this outfit. And it's just a shame that when I say a beautiful woman like yourself, you would judge me based off of what Baby, I'm Baby, say that. Because you approached me with the intention of me because of how I'm coming. So because I already know that you're not approaching me for my personality. You're approaching me because I'm a big booty, big booty. So that's all right. Cool. I ain't tripping. But same for me. I'm not going to approach no, you know what I'm saying, minimum wage. It's me. Now, you own a franchise. Now we talking. You know? I make you look good and you make me feel good. So what we own? Uh, uh yeah. Um, so I take it that you're single, right? And you're of course. And you go out on a date. So and even if I wasn't, maybe he ain't coming the way you coming. So what that got to do with you? So even if you weren't single? You even if I wasn't single, that has nothing to do with you. You you got stars in the ceiling. I'm already seeing the mother... <laughs> I'm already... You see your future, huh? Yeah. <laughs> you see your future, huh? See your future. I want to see the eclipse. You want to see your clip? The the eclipse. Oh, that's for the sun and the moon come together. <laughs> okay, so how are you? The dirty dipper. You feel me? How old are you, Tamika? I just turned twenty-seven. Tamika, 27. I'm a Leo. Leo What's huh? up? We like nice things. Yeah. Are you able to provide that? I mean, it's like like like. Cause I'm you in a Rolls Royce. You're not in a mother Kia, so. So on our first date, like what type of stuff you expect? Like we can go. To I'm my expecting house. you to show me a good time. We can go to watch Netflix at my house. Like I said, I uh, know. You, I, fried no. green you all you got to offer me with that is a fucking cold water bottle and a no, hugs and a mother maybe a blunt. I got fried green tomatoes at home. I can fry. Oh, okay. And, make and what else? Because I like salmon and shrimp. We can watch Netflix or Tubi. Mm, Tubi is more my thing. I can buy. Netflix some, I, I think I got some catfish mm. nuggets in the freezer. Mm. Okay. I mean, everything. Hookah? Weed. Oh, I don't do that. Then, all right, we can. We, we, you, I mean, clearly, look, it's cool. You can provide the experience, maybe just not all of it, but you can provide some of it. I'm okay with it. Like, look how you come in. Red is my favorite color, foxy red. That's what I like. And, you know. Okay, well, let me. Well, we, What's your name, baby? Get up out of here. I told mm -hmm. you my name was Damien. Oof. Foxy red, right? Mm. Well, listen. Damien and Foxy, mother red. Don't play with it. Don't play with it. And you what? Uh, you knew you. You're not even from Houston, baby. I'm gonna show you what the Houston is about. Stop playing with me, acting like you ain't about that type of time. Look how you came. You look. Look how you came with me. You approached me on ten. Okay, and you acted speechless all all because I saw you coming into this Rolls Royce. Because you're beautiful, that's what I'm okay. Could I just make one suggestion, please, mm. to me? Just one suggestion. What? Before like we go, is there any way I could suggest or convince you to dye your hair gold? Because like being in Houston is you know like one of the gold dig one of the best thing about being a gold digger is you should have oh, your hair gold dyed digger. gold. Gold digger. You're, you you you're gonna put me in the category of a gold digger all because you approached me in a McDonald's outfit you're a gold digger to a to Rose me, I'm not a gold digger. I just know what the fuck I want. Well, you got and the and the way the same way you knew what you want, the same way you knew what you want, you know what the fuck I want. So I can brand new. The fuck you, you in Houston. Where everywhere you look at is a bad So act like you know what the is what I want. The f quit acting brand new. You see this family right here passing right by us? They on, they, look, she ain't give him two kids for nothing. He came heavy. You feel me? And he didn't come in a f 
Chevy Cruze. There's a doorknob right there, please. I need to, I got something I gotta get. Oh, I'ma exit, but you're gonna make sure I'm straight before I exit. Hello? What do you mean straight? Man? Um, You got stars in the ceiling, you got red seats. Make sure I'm good, make sure I'm okay before I even talk to you. Okay, can I? What? Can you, you know how to open the door now? Oh, I can open the door. You gonna open it for me? Cause I'm a lady. Yes, ma'am. Thank you. You talking about? I'm a gold digger, baby. You just don't. You just trying to have me settle for less, and that's not what I'm finna be about. You approach me cause I'm a big booty, big booby, and I'm a you because you wasn't riding in a Chevy Cruze. You riding in a Rolls Royce. So that tells me you got franchises, baby, and that's what I like. Understood. You take care of yourself. Okay. At DJ Foxy Red F A U X Y. And before you try to approach a real like me, you better come heavy. Do you understand what I just said, yes. sir? Yes, I do. That's All right. Mine. Mm -hmm. One of your boobs is hanging out. You might want to tuck it back in. Then fix it. I have to go. I have an appointment. Oh, you have a wife now? All of a sudden? No, ma'am. I have an appointment. Oh, an appointment to... with me. Meet me outside at the bar. Don't play with me tomorrow. To act like you all about oh i'm a regular regular man nah you is a mother interested man you saw a bad walking the sidewalk act like it yes ma'am now you're gonna dm me and you're gonna take me somewhere nice lamb chops and lobster mac and cheese and we're gonna call it a night yes, and we're gonna see each other again yes we will take care What the f Hey man, I'm about to move out of Houston, bro. I'm about to leave Houston right now. They getting crazier and crazier out here, bro. These females out here, man, they scandalous, bro. Did y'all hear that? She told me what I was gonna do, when I was gonna do it, and how I was gonna do it. Only in Houston, bro. <sighs> Moving on to the next one.